Hey guys and welcome to my channel. I'm Andrea and this is my first ever video on YouTube. So it's a DIY tutorial of making your own watercolour travel set. I hope you enjoy this video and keep on watching how I make this. So let's get started. So the things that you need is a palette. Um, your half pans. I have here my Winsor & Newton 12 half pan palette. Um, any palette will do. Next thing is to have a tin box. You can find this one at Marks & Spencer's for a pound. Then you're going to need a plastic container to place the mints into. You're going to need glue as well. And you're going to be needing a scalpel. Please be careful with this and ask a parent if you're under age. Okay, so we're going to grab our plastic container and empty out the mints from the tin. It gets quite fiddly, don't worry. You're going to be left with like a powder at the end of the um, removing the mints but all you're going to do is grab a piece of tissue and clean it up. So that's one step done. The next step is to grab your uh, palette and all these colours we're going to remove with a scalpel. So we're just going to grab our scalpel and we're going to remove our half pan. Since I've been using this half pan, um, the, the pans get a bit moist and sticky and they don't want to come out. So that's the reason why we're using a scalpel. Please be careful, I did snap the tip of my scalpel. So yeah, just be careful. Sometimes um, you need to stab the insides of the pan for it to come out like in a second. See? It does get a bit tedious but once that's done, we move on to our next step. So once you have it empty, you can reuse your plastic palette for something else. Now it's time for the glue. I would recommend rearranging your colours how you want them to be placed onto the tin box. Another tip is to align one of your half pans according to the open hatch uh, and you'll get like a symmetrical layout so it won't be all wonky or all over the place. So we're going to dab a bit of glue onto the centre and spread that glue around without putting any more glue onto the pan. Because what we want to do after a while is remove that pan and replace other colours that we want in the tin box. This glue does come out so you don't have to worry. And as you can see I am like lining it up symmetrically and that is my guideline to to the rest of the pants that I'm going to be sticking down so keep on doing that So you're going to allow the glue to dry for 15 to 30 minutes and at this moment you need to press down firmly onto the half pans for them to attach to the tin and to dry as quick as possible. What I like to do is to have a paintbrush with me it could be either this one or the water brushes. 
I also like to keep my rubber with me and a piece of tissue just in case something spills or I want to wipe off something off my brush. Um, yeah, so get your sketchbooks, get out there, get inspired and yeah, I hope you like this DIY tutorial. Thanks for watching and please do like and subscribe and comment down below in what I need to improve. So thanks guys, have a great day, bye!